What's up, gang, and welcome back to another edition of Road Tripping with the Roots. Hi, guys. And if this is your first time tuning in, thank you so much for joining us. Mm -hmm. Please be sure to subscribe, hit that notification bell, and like this video. If you have been riding with us all along, thank you so much. Please be sure to comment down below so that we know that you're here. Like this video and share it because we got some heat coming your way this month. Yeah, Vlogmas on deck. Nicole loves when I say on deck. So, Vlogmas is on deck. And this I, is day one. I only love when he says on deck when we are actually on deck of a ship. Deck 11. Hey, babe, where you at? I'm on deck 11. Deck 11. Yeah, at the uh, pool. So, guys, um, if you are not familiar with Vlogmas, Vlogmas was actually created by Ingrid Nielsen uh, in 2011. And this was her way of kind of doing a virtual... Uh, advent calendar or, or vlog advent calendar so um, we have to pay homage to the great mm -hmm. um, she's since stopped vlogging um, five months ago she's stepped away but um, she definitely set the trend for everyone else trendsetter. And, um, yes Ch -ch -ch trendsetter mm -hmm. um, so we weren't going to do we were on the fence about this right yes. I mean, it's pretty intense. You are producing content every day, and it's not like you're doing content on Instagram, which I love doing, but it's not as labor intensive as this. So let me let me start out on day one. Don't get used to daily vlogs from us, okay? We're not going to be daily vlogging every day. We're going to do it this month, and then I'm falling back. We'll see. I'm falling we'll see. back. We'll see. So... Um, you know, it's a lot of things on the back end. Um, Corey is a saint. Fall back game strong. Listen, <laughs> Corey is a saint because he edits my flubs. I am, um, super over analytical and there's like a million things I want to say to you. And then the words get jumbled. You know, life happens. Mm -hmm. life, life comes at you fast when you're thinking. Okay. Um, so just doing that and then with the girls, with their schedule, um, with our holiday shopping, you know, it, it's a lot. But when I look back at 2020 and I um, think of all of the times that people have reached out to us with words of encouragement or support, um, yeah, 2020 was crazy, but we wouldn't have been able to get through without you guys. Right. So um, if we could power through for 31 days... Um, that's the least that we can do. So mm -hmm. let's start off there. Um, get used to seeing the girls a lot. We yeah. are, um, they're, we're always together. Um, and they're the reason why we started vlogging. Right. And we won't always be in my glorious, luxurious Funko office. You know what I'm saying? My Funko studio. So, okay. <laughs> let me, let me just give you guys an idea. Corey has designed this space like a, um, Man in a midlife crisis getting a, a two-seater coupe, okay? Mm. So, all four of us won't fit in here. And if all four of us are in this space, that means Chala, who is our Kane Corso, is having a meltdown. Um, <laughs> comment down below if your dog has um, separation anxiety. But mm. Chala always has to be with, like, one of us. So, um, we'll probably vlog uh, more in our common spaces. Um, so... Mm, I don't common need, areas. Common yeah. areas, right? Oh I don't goodness. I don't need I don't need everyone picking over, oh well she didn't sort this or she didn't wipe this down or we got you know common what? areas though. I know we even well, have I common mean, areas. You know what? This is your share this is your sacred space. Okay. I feel like Ella has her space. Ava has her space. Mm -hmm. I've got, you know, my space outside. My space is gonna soon to be expanding. So as I was as I was saying, um, you know, I don't need anyone to pick over my housekeeping skills and what have you. Yeah. <laughs> Mom ain't easy. We looking all in the and, background. Right. Y'all know how y'all be doing. Right. And we don't see. we don't do phony, right? I, I think that's why people have tuned in. Um if you see me with a clear glass, know that it might be water, it might be wine. Mm. It, just just know that, that there there are some chances where it might be one. A lot more times it's the Mine other. will be Coquito. Y'all might as well know that right now. <laughs> if you haven't seen that video, please be sure to do so. I tell you this much. 
Thank you everyone that has reached out um, and let us know that they've done the coquito recipe and mm. that it was a hit. Mm -hmm. um, I'll be doing a little bit more in the kitchen uh, over Vlogmas. Really? Ava, oh <laughs> Ava will be baking. She's the oh. baker of the family. Okay. Are I'm you gonna, doing anything in the kitchen? I'm going to be Tim the Tool Man Taylor. I'm going to do some home improvement stuff. Mm. Guys, I'm not about to let him burn down my house for Vlogmas. Oh, okay? my God. So, I love you, but I need a roof over my head. So, he's not going to be doing too much. Yeah, okay. I'm going to be doing the most. <laughs> um, so, tune in. Stay tuned. We're super excited. Be sure to comment down below of maybe some things that you want to see. Hey. Uh, we want to keep it a surprise. Give so us some ideas, gonna... though. I would love some ideas that we may not have thought of already, you know. So, you know, however, what we got? 1.8K? 1.8K heads are better than two. Yeah. Absolutely. Yeah. Absolutely. So, um, let us know. And, again... Thank you so much for watching. Thank you so much for riding with yeah, us. Um, we truly, truly appreciate everyone. Um, and if we help your days. This really actually was a bright spot. Yes. In the entire year of 2020. Absolutely. So actually if, getting in here and vlogging. Yes. If we help have helped you in any way over the year, uh, please be sure to share it with your friends and yeah. let's spread the love. I want to do a huge shout out. I'm not going to say the person's name, but I want they, they'll know. But if I want to do you know. right. If you know, you know. I want to do a huge shout out to the person who um, kind of talked, spoke with me about Vlogmas and um, the value of it. And you know, like sometimes you'll like talk yourself out of things, and you'll be like, okay, I can't do this, or you know that that doubt creeps in. So. Um, it takes a special um, type of person to be able to say, hey, listen, this is what you need to do. You've mm -hmm. got to do it. And to that person, um, thank you very much. Yeah. Thank you so much. And also to that person, you know, ask me first, okay? Because then I'll say, <laughs> probably not. Just kidding. <laughs> Guys, don't ask Corey because, you know, if you and if you're not doing so already, please be sure to follow us on Instagram, Facebook, at Road Tripping with the Roods, on our webpage, uh, roadtrippingwiththeroods.com, or on Twitter, Road Rules. Make sure that you follow us. But um, Corey manages that account for the most part. So when you send Corey messages through Instagram, guys, I, I, don't, I don't know. I don't know where it goes. Um, you can, you can email us. <laughs> I get that info at roadtrippingwiththeroots.com. But you know, sometimes those messages with Corey, I don't know. Yeah, no, I'll take care of them all. <laughs> We're good. Don't worry. Keep messaging. <laughs> so guys, thank you to, for tuning into this video. We look forward to seeing you 30 more times yeah. this month. Mm -hmm. Um, fun fact, we have not done our... Uh, holiday shopping for the girls um we we have a I holiday exchange coming up and so you know we've done that but we yeah. haven't done the girls so you'll probably be shopping with us i love lot. last minute shopping though that's me um i i will i will say guys i've had so much anxiety around um fun fact I am an introvert i'm an outgoing introvert if that makes mm -hmm. sense so i've always um with exception of Disney environments, have had anxiety with large groups of people. So I am never really big on shopping or crowds. The pandemic has just heightened that for me. Yeah, no, I don't do the crowds. You know that. But yeah. I go in, I get what I need to get, and I get up out of there. And that was pre-pandemic. So. Yeah, I, I think um, it's so different this year. I, I think why. Well, absolutely have to put more thought into um what we get the girls um because we don't know how long we'll be hunkered down so i don't know but you guys will be with us i'm sure y'all see my face more thought for her <laughs> me i'm a gift card kind of guy gift card and cash that's easy you can't what I i'm that person that puts some serious thought into she is. every single gift and 
you know, maybe we'll talk about it, but I've, I've got quite the reputation for being thoughtful you when it comes to gift giving. But, you know, I'm going to say this right now. Gift cards and cash, they get the biggest cheers. I'm just saying. I'm a crowd favorite. <sighs> Comment down below if gift cards and cash is the way to go or if thoughtful gift giving is the way to go. Okay, yeah, I, I'm going I'm to love to see these comments. So, guys, again, thank you for tuning in. Yeah. Please stay tuned. We'll mm -hmm. have more coming your way. Actually, see y'all tomorrow. We will see you manana. Yeah. So, until the next time, tomorrow. Keep tripping. <laughs> Bye, guys. <laughs>